finally, the number one hero is here. Let's start the review. Right, so finally, the wait is over for this amazing Yamaguchi Rebel Tech Endeavor. Um, there's a, they had a delay. Supposedly, it should have been released in December last year, but it was pushed back to February of 2023. But now we have this great release from Rebel Tech. So, as you can see, this is the box. So, typical window type. Um, of course, the image of um, the figure. My Hero Academia, Amazing Yamaguchi, powered by Rebel Tech. Some more poses. And then, yep. Yep. And then, let's pop out the figure out of the box then. Okay, so as you can see, it has two trays. So originally, you can get this out of the box like this. And then it contains two trays with also this uh, stand and some, um, I think these are joints, yeah. I think you're gonna be able to use it on the fire, the fire effect and then some manual. Okay, so actually um, I received this figure during work. So I've already opened it earlier, checked the inside of the box. I've already removed the plastic covering on the joints. I think it's to protect the rubbing of paints. Um, so as you can see, this is the whole figure with the full uh, faceplate. Actually, it's the whole head. It's not the faceplate. Though there are some, um, like, you can replace the eyes. Yeah. So as you can see, there is a default head. There are three extra heads. Um, let me see. Let me close up. So angry, grinning face. And then um, I think this is the part where um, his uh, left eye was damaged by the Nomu. So there's like a bleeding, blinded left eye expression and then we have the the uh, the plus ultra what's this um, the final uh, is it no the final technique no it's a pro, plus ultra prominence burn yeah a face yeah. and then aside from that there are like four extra um eyepiece so Later, I'm gonna show you how to replace it. It'll be, it's easy, guys. So, one looking to the left, to the right, looking straight, and then like the white out angry. I think this, this is nice. The angry one with the cartoonish popping of vein expression. Yeah. And then some hands, relaxed hands. Oh, he has a cell phone. Yeah. I think Shoto has a cell phone as well. And then one like glowing, like the glowing hands. And, and also, we also have a bunch of um, like a flaming effect parts. I think this, you will put this on his back. And then uh, for like the fire punches. Uh, I think you put it on his feet. You can make him like uh, fly or hover. Yeah, and as uh, um, Endeavor says, he's not falling. He's not flying, but he's not falling. I don't know if you get that um, uh, uh, reference. There's an episode that um, Hawks is uh, surprised that Endeavor is uh, flying, and. Endeavor said, I, I don't, "I'm not sure if this is exact. Like, no, I'm, I'm just, I'm just I'm not falling. I, I, I see it funny for Endeavor to say that. So let me remove him from the tray. So 
here you go close up so his costume is somewhat um, glossy later I'm gonna compare it with the All Might I have the All Might figure actually actually I'm impressed on the the flame effects actually it really looks like he's glowing I love the dry the, like, the no not, this is not the dry brush it's technique of paint but I love it it really looks like glowing and at the back side there are some ports in which you can attach the um, the flames at the back you could put like a wing of flames or it depends on how you're gonna configure it okay and then uh, let's move forward to the articulation then okay for articulation I think it will be the same like um, in all might as well for sure you've seen the reviews but I though not in my channel but from other um, toy reviewers so let's start oh it's my cat that's Koga yeah so you can look up like so down I think that's the best he can do but the most amazing thing with this figure is that like whenever you articulate the head there's like a floating piece inside oh yeah have you seen that one there's like a cover it covers the the joint that's amazing oh oh anyways anyways it it popped up the eyes popped off so this is how you um, replace the eyes so there's some hole there you just have to slot the eyes let me just grab one um, IP let me just wait okay we're gonna put this the angry expression yeah that one that easy let's put it back then for the shoulder part I thought that there will be some um, hindrance to the no actually there is, is it so it can move up like that move down um, how about oh he can he can yeah. mm -hmm. that's for the shoulder or the elbow that's so good and then wrist is it a ball joint what kind of yeah, it's a ball hinge it's a ball hinge yeah and then um, for all rebel text like they have like the butterfly they have a cut here you can move forward yeah like this and that rocks forward and um, backwards actually yeah as you can see yeah um, oops. it's kind of fidgety and for the ab crunch oh boy look how good is the ab crunch here this is the oh here amazing right and then how about backwards 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 yeah that's that's the maximum one and then for the hips actually there is like a ball joint here you could move this you could um adjust this one yeah you can adjust this according to the and how you're gonna articulate the hips can do the splits yep you can do the splits because of this um, thing that you could uh, articulate so it can do that make made it possible um, you can move like this then that's the maximum we could get this there's a cut here and then for the knee joint 
there are like two articulation actually here directly on the knee and then it's like this one the boots and then the leg part the shin part is like um because there's an articulation here huh? yep i think there's a ball joint inside i think Again, let's appreciate the the paint works here. It really looks like it's glowing. It's like burning. Even the shoes. See? So, ankle rockers. Toe joint. And I think they have corrected the issues regarding the ankle joints. If you own um, an All Might figure, I will tell the the ankle articulation it's so loose. I don't know if it's only my figure, but definitely it's loose. Later I'm gonna show you like the comparison. So I think that's it for the articulation. And um, I'm gonna show you the the fully assembled um, back piece because there's like there should be flames here but I think you could display your um, endeavor like this as well it's good enough actually it's not good enough but it's already great but I'm gonna show you as well like the fully assembled uh, thing at the back okay okay so I've attached actually I just attached the two two um, flame effects um, actually, there are four. As you, there are four, but I uh, just decided to. I don't know. I think that's enough. But you have the idea on what he looks like with the fire effects. Maybe let's get all night. It's all night. I think they are the same height. Though. Are they the same height? I know. All Might is taller. All Might is taller. All Might is taller. So you can really can see the difference between the physics of both uh, figures. So it is not. I thought it is uh, like a recast. Like they will use the same body, but no, it's a completely different um, uh, sculpt. Then Shoto. They look nice together. Shoto. Here. Oh, I, I forgot earlier. So, just to share. So, from the previous All Might, so they really have like an issue on the ankle joint so if you can see it's really it's really, it's really floppy it's really floppy i think the they and sometimes they have the figure have difficulty of uh, standing but on the um endeavor figure it's solid it's solid just like uh, it's, it's tight it's tight enough that it could support its own um, weight which is good i think they've changed Ah, I really cannot see here, but they've changed the way the the, the joint is attached. Because here in with All Might, as you can see, mm, there's like a lot of space here, which makes the ankle unstable. So yeah, just to share with you guys. Okay, so my final verdict on this uh, figure. I will rate this figure as 10 out of 10. This is a strong release from Amazing Yamaguchi. Um, I'm looking forward for the Hawks. I also pre-ordered that one. And I'm very, very um, excited to get that figure as well. So, at least uh, Revol Tech is really making um, some improvements on their figures. So, no more floppy joints. I love the way how it articulated. I love the 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 plethora of um, accessories. Really worth your money. And if you, you are really a fan of um, My Hero Academia, I really recommend to 
get this video this is worth your money i can say so yeah if you like my um review just uh, hit the like button and subscribe to my channel and um yeah next uh, i think next month fox will uh, come so i'm gonna review that as well soon all right